Hi guys, this is Teacher Mel and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Shout out to all my subscribers and to all my math fanatics. Thanks so much for watching my videos and subscribing. So today we're going to learn about percentage on how to convert percentage into uh, fractions. So are you ready to learn? So let's go. So when we talk about percentage or percent, it means out of 100. For example, if you have 50%, yeah? so if you have 50%, so it's out of 100, that means you have 50 out of 100, right? So how to simplify this fraction? So we all know that 50 and 100 is both divisible by 50. So 50 divided 50 is 1, and then 100 divided 50 is 2. So 50% in fraction is 1 half, right? Okay, another example. So if you have let's say 40 percent so 40 percent again so percent means out of 100 so that means you have 40 out of 100 right so you can cut zero here so the remaining is 4 out of 10 okay and 4 and 10 is divisible by 2 so 4 divided by 2 is 2 10 divided by 2 is 5 so 40% in fraction in lowest term is 2 over 5. Another example, if you have, uh, let's say, 8%. So 8% in fraction is 8 out of 100. Okay? So 8 and 100 is divisible by, let's start with, with the smallest number. 8 divided by 2 is 4 right and 100 divided by 2 is 50 okay but 4 and 50 is still divisible by 2 so 4 divided by 2 is 2 okay and 50 divided by 2 is 25 right so 8% in fraction is 2 over 25 all right now what if you have let's say 9.5 percent yeah so what is that what is the equivalent in fraction so all you have to do is 9.5 over 100 okay but as you can see there's a decimal to remove the decimal number, okay, so since there is one number after the decimal point, we can multiply it by 10, both the numerator and then the denominator. So 9.5 times 10 is 95, over 100 times 10 is 1000. Now, 95 and 1000 is divisible by 5, right? So 95 divided 5 is... 19 and 1000 divided 5 is 200 so the answer so 9.5 percent in fraction is 19 over 200 okay so that is the answer okay so let's take another example for example if you have one point 25 percent right so we can convert this in fraction like 1.25 over 100 now so before we convert it into the fraction properly let's remove the decimal point so since we have two decimal point here we can multiply it by 100. So 
Oh, one red. So 1.25 times one red is 125. And 100 times 100 is one, two, three, two, three, four. So it's 10,000. So as you can see here, 125 and 10,000 are both divisible by 25. Okay, let's start with the smallest. So 25, 125 divided by 25 is what? So we can divide it by 25. Right, so 125 divided by 25 is five, yeah? That is five and and ten thousand divided by twenty five is four hundred. Yeah. So, but we will not stop unless this five over four hundred is the lowest term. But as you can see, five and four hundred is still divisible by five. So we can write here. 5 divided by 5 is 1 and 400 divided by 5 is 80 so 1.25% in fraction is 1 over 80 Okay, let's take another example. So for example, if you have 72%, okay? So 72% is equal to 72 over 100. Now, as you can see here, 72 and 100 is divisible by a two. Let's take the smaller number. So 72 divided by two is 36 okay? and 100 divided by 2 is 50 okay? and 36 and 50 is still divisible by by 2 so 36 divided by 2 is 18 and 50 divided by 2 is 25 okay? so 72% is equal to 18 over 25 in fraction. So we will stop here because 18 and 25 is not divisible by a common number or the same number. So we can stick to this fraction. Okay, for the last example, if you have 1.275%, so we can rewrite this in fraction as 1.275 over 100. So before we convert it directly, we have to remove the decimal point. So in what way? Since this is three decimal numbers, so we can multiply it by a thousand. So times 1,000 and then times 1,000. So 1.275 times 1,000 is 1 to 75 divide over 100 times 1,000 is just copy one and then add 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 zeros. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So that is 100,000. And 1 to 75 is divisible by 25, same as 200,000 yeah so the answer is when you divide 1 to 75 by 25 the answer is 51 and when you divide 100,000 by 25 the answer is 4,000 so since there is no number that we can divide 51 and 4,000 so we can let this as our answer. So 1.275 in fraction is 51 over 4,000. So if you want to learn more topics or lessons in maths, 
please don't forget to subscribe like and share my videos and don't forget to click the bell so that you will get notified the next time I uploaded my video okay so bye for now